Hold on. It's dirty. It's dirty on the lens. Sorry. <laughs> Good morning, friends. I am excited to say hello today. We are really gearing up for Christmas and trying to get everything ready. I'm trying to clean up my front entry. As you can see, it's become a dumping zone, which drives me crazy, but with how things have been going this last week, it's just been really hard to stay on top of things and having priorities that have deadlines that are quicker than I can handle. So. I'm working on getting this clean so that I can just look at our beautiful tree and not have anything in the way and just have it look really festive as you walk in the doors. We've got some cards from grandmas and great grandmas. So those have been added to our tree, which is fun. I see the girls put their candy canes on the tree. Sometimes I do the tree the way I want it and then little things like find their way slipped in added here and there, but that's okay because it's their tree too. So that's what we're working on today and we are trying to get our last little bit of shopping and our last little bit of wrapping done so that tomorrow we're going to do something kind of special. We are going over to be with uh, some family. Hold on. Dirty, dirty on the lens. Sorry. Going over to be with some family um, on Christmas Eve and Christmas morning. And so we decided that since we have a lot of other grandma and grandpa presents here, that we're going to also wake up tomorrow morning, which would be Christmas Eve day and have a, um, our own little Christmas morning alone where we open up our presents from the grandmas and grandpas who are out of town and we don't have to haul everything with us over there and, uh, and then we can have a nice little fancy breakfast with some you know, eggs and bacon and either waffles or pancakes, I don't know yet, so we'll decide on that. Mm -hmm. Get him his Moochoo toy. Uh, uh, moo moo there he is. Ooh. Can I something, people? Yes. Puppy, the it's gonna look like this, and I am going and written and illustrated. Cute. So I'm not, and so it's gonna be published sometime, and that. So you want everybody to buy it? Yeah. All right. What about yours? What's yours called? Well, I didn't write it yet, but mine's gonna be called, um. The baby's first Christmas. Mm. Actually, Chase's first Cute. Christmas. Cute. I like that. I've said before how much I appreciate the clouds and the sky. And, oops, that makes it too dark. But I walked past our living room windows, and I just want to show you how beautiful. No, I'm not talking to you. How beautiful the sun. Like, it stopped me dead in my tracks. Let me see if I can show it to you in a way that you can actually see it. Okay. Does that help? No, maybe not. I mean, oh, it's just gorgeous. Cameron's a nature lover. I am a nature lover. Oh, my. It's like a fire. Oh, I love, love it. Oh, it's so pretty. It's amazing. I love the sky. I love lamp. You love lamp? Oh, I love sky. Hi. Hi. I love you. Girls, guess what? I'm on Christmas break. No work for the next six days. Woohoo! So what's that mean? You get to play with us. We get to play together. Are you excited? Yeah. So we get to go. Uh, we can go grocery shopping, and we no. can clean up the house, no. and we can do dishes. No. And and you guys can unload the dishwasher, and no. we can we need oodles and oodles of spaghetti, no. and some soup. All your very favorites, just no. because I'm that kind of a dad. Oh. Yes. Finally, we can make sushi. Ooh, maybe we can make sushi. Have you guys seen our sushi video? We make homemade sushi, and it's really delicious. And we I made a video of it, sushi. and I will post that link in the description below. Hey, pretty lady. Below. Below, doing your hair? Oh, yeah. Guys, it's gloomy outside. It's, it's got some rain. It's like... It's been in the 50s all day, but it totally looks like snow sky out there. Mm -hmm. I miss the snow sky. Remember when we had the snow sky? Every winter when we lived in Idaho. You look outside and it'd be all just this gray color and you know snow was coming. Well, it's different here. The gray color means that rain's coming. It could mean that ice is coming. It could mean that summer storm is coming. Okay, little lady. Okay. Let's get rocking and rolling and get this vacation started. I'm just saying that. 
I'm sick. You're not sick. It's all in your head. That's and in and and in your throat. A little bit in your throat. And a little bit in your chest. <laughs> okay, hey, come over here. Come here. Come here. All right, guys. So I found this app on the, the Google Play Store, and it's called Push Ups. Your personal fitness trainer. And what it does is it uses your proximity sensor on your phone, and so every time you do a push-up and you get your nose close to your phone, it counts your push-ups, and then it helps you set up a training regimen. Check this out. Ready? So you put it down on the floor, and then you do push-ups. One. See? Look. Did you see it? Look. One. Can I zoom? Ready? In? Nope. Two. Oh, I touched the ad with my nose. Dang it. Three. See, look. You didn't count number five, though. Dang it. <laughs> five. <laughs> it's not counting. Oh, my gosh, Dad. I heard your elbows pop. I know. I'm doing as many push-ups as I can. It's not counting very well. All right. So maybe there's some bugs they need to get worked out of it. But yeah. in theory, it'd be really cool if it worked. I'm doing all these push-ups. For nothing now. There we go. Now it's counting. Nope. Dang it! I hit the ad with my nose again. Brayler is gonna try it over the thing. One. Good job. Two. It's working for you. Three. So it probably works better if you disable the ad by buying the full app. But uh, I think as long as you keep your nose away from the ads, I think it should work pretty well. Uh, the proximity sensor seemed to work really well. It's just a matter of making sure that it registers. So you probably just need to be in the right position or something like that, I'm thinking. But what other apps are out there that are fitness related that you guys like? Do you have any recommendations? Anything that I should check out? Leave it in the comments below. All right. One. Two. Three. Good job. Still going? Oh my god. I did you did it? 16. Okay, good job, guys. Oh. <laughs> hey, buddy. We're all just hanging out here listening to Christmas music. It's the coolest thing. We don't have any TV shows turned on. We're just listening to Christmas music. What's your favorite Christmas song? Uh, and Harry Potter Christmas songs. Harry Potter Christmas songs? There are no such things. We just like them. What's yours, Kaya? Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Rudolph the, the Red no Noise Reindeer? No. The Red Schnoz Reindeer? All I want for Christmas is my two front teeth. Because two... I'm in my two front teeth. I already kind of have them. What's your favorite one, Cam? Christmas song? Oh. Ow! No, really. You know what song I really like? I like the one that's like... Um, baby, it's cold outside. Yeah, that's what it's called, baby, it's cold outside. Oh, that's the one I like, I guess. All right, we're at Target once more, and Cameron's I, getting distracted. I, I saw my friend Kelton. Looking at the scrap crap. I saw my friend Kelton. Wait, what are we here for? I saw Name my friend Kelton. I saw my friend Kelton. You did? Oh my gosh, that's so awesome, dude. With the whole family riding on the car. Besides mom. Besides mom, well, that'd be just weird. I don't think it'd work either. Where's she going? We'll catch up. We're gonna catch up. Here we go. Where's mom? Ready? Hold on tight. I'm going. Yes! Don't be careful. It's a breakable stall. <laughs> Sorry, Ray. <Taylor. laughs> this is kind of breakable. Garbage can fiasco. Cam, if you can hear me, whistle. She can't whistle. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can hear me holler. You didn't whistle. Oh, that's okay. I said if you can if you can hear me whistle. Then I couldn't hear you. But you can't whistle. Is what we decided. Yes, I can. Or what we we remembered. You're whistling. Try and whistle. Yep. Pretty much exactly how we expected it to go. Gotta have the kirkender, cause we love the kirkender. Kirkender, kirkender, kirkender. On me, on me, on me. We love the kirkender. On me, on me, on me, on me. Uh -uh. Yeah. Can so you get? If you say kirkender, 
Kirkadur. 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 Did you just say you're gonna kill us? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are crazy. Okay, we're at store number two now. Tom Femme, we're gonna make an awesome good morning Christmas Eve breakfast tomorrow because on Thursday we're gonna be over at Canvas Folks House in the morning. We're not gonna have a big giant breakfast, so tomorrow we're gonna make a warm, awesome breakfast with potatoes and eggs and open, bacon. We get and to it's gonna be awesome. Presents tomorrow. And we're gonna open some presents tomorrow. We're gonna open just a few because all of the ones that we don't want to take over to Camber's parents' house, we're going to open tomorrow. So that way we can have kind of like our own little Christmas. Camber's in work mode right now. She's highly focused on the task at hand of getting delicious breakfast treats and goodies. All right, guys. Well, the day is just about over. And Camber and I, I think we're all prepared for our pre-Christmas Christmas tomorrow. Christmas Eve, Christmas... Oh, present opening thing tomorrow. <laughs> so we've got, um, Camber's got all the presents wrapped that she wants to. You have all your presents wrapped? Is that what you just did? All right. Well, that's all. That's all for today. All right. Um, make sure to join us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Scott and Camber. And then we're both on Twitter as well. So that's it. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.